Good morning, happy Friday. Sissy and I are sitting outside. It is a beautiful day, it's September 1st. We love fall season. Except it's literally gonna be 90 degrees this week, so <laughs> that's funny. We still have a birthday balloon sitting out here. Sissy's got a cup of coffee over there. I got my ice roller, my water. We're having a little morning moment before we start this day. It is 8.37 a.m. I gotta work out, get the vlog up. Sissy has a wedding later, so that's the plans today. Are you coming to hang out with us? All right, happy Friday. It's time for my Friday workout, and this is my, all of my <laughs> athletic clothes are in the dryer outfit. I'm wearing like these old, like stretchy, not even athletic biker shorts. Well, this is a pretty good top. I'm about to get in my HIIT workout. Sissy went to bed last night, and ironically, me and my parents stayed up and watched an episode of Claim to Fame. So we're gonna rewatch that while I'm working out. Perfect. And then I'm gonna edit, get my vlog up. It's gonna be a good start to the weekend. We're already doing good. Great start to the Friday. Whoever wins today's challenge. I'm gonna run a straighter through it quick just to get it, you know, stop trying, right? And I feel like we'll burn our All right, we have had ourselves a morning, got our workout in, I just got some editing done. Excuse my appearance, look how red my cheeks are. Um, I was supposed to do my little glow up last night. I was supposed to like exfoliate, get on a fresh tan and all that. And my parents were over. If you watched the last vlog, we had like a little night out with my sister and it just got late and I was just like way too tired. So I'm gonna do that today, later, not right now. So this is where I'm at right now. So with that being said, it's just a busy day. I have to get some work done. So I need a quick and easy lunch. I'm gonna go with good old factor. This has been saving me this week. I only have a few left. I've been just running through them because I needed it. So thank you so much to Factor for sponsoring today's video. If you've never heard of them before, they are fresh, never frozen meals. They are dietitian approved and they get delivered straight to your door. Literally all you need to do is poke a few holes with a fork, microwave it for two minutes and you have a delicious meal. I've tried so many of them and they are all so yummy, especially their chicken, sometimes reheated chicken can just get like dried out and not as good. And you would be shocked that this got delivered to your door. It tastes so fresh. They have tons of different types of meals. I personally love the calorie smart ones. They're all about 550 calories or less. All of their meals are packed with so much flavor. And the best part is you don't have to prep anything and there's no mess at all. They have over 34 options of meals to choose from every single week. And there's also tons of add-ons like a breakfast skillet. They have egg bites, pancakes, you name it. Smoothies are really good. I have some of those in the fridge right now. Anywho, now I'm really hungry, so let's get it going in the microwave. Oh, by the way, I didn't even tell you guys which one I was having. This is a new one for me, white chicken chili. I haven't tried it yet. I've been eating them throughout the week. I already ate some of my favorites. The uh, basil chicken tomato risotto is so fire. Highly recommend that one. Also, if you did not know, they're actually owned by HelloFresh. So you guys know I work with both of them. I like to give you the option. I personally love the option because sometimes I want to cook and sometimes I want to be lazy and I need things in a pinch when I'm busy. So both absolutely delicious. It just depends on your week and what you got going on, you know? We're gonna pretend I didn't just do a little taste test and forgot to hit record, but it's so good. I love a sauce. You guys know me. Mm, it literally tastes like I've been making this for the last three hours homemade. If you guys wanna try it out for yourself, you can head to factor75.com and use the code Alyssa50 for 50% 50 off of your first box. Again, head to factor75.com and use code Alyssa50 for 50% 50 off of your first box. You'll love it. Oh yeah, I've been doing my laundry for four days. Oh no. Did you ask mom and dad if they want to go out tomorrow? Uh. Oh, hello.
everyone happy saturday yesterday was kind of a fail of a day i literally was just at my computer all day so you didn't miss much but i ended up being able to do my self-care shower i'm gonna get my vlog up this morning i finished editing it and watching it but it was too late to upload so we're gonna uh, make the thumbnail right now and upload that i wanted to cook dinner last night too i ended up just eating another faster meal but you know it is what it is but i am feeling a little refreshed today i'm glad i got my shower in i got my laser hair done i got on a fresh tan we still have to rinse but i feel better obviously my sister's here so i've been trying to spend a little time with her so yesterday we definitely like chatted in the morning outside and then we watched an episode of our show midday so so after i get the vlog up i think i'm gonna go to zumba because i didn't go saturday or sunday last weekend and i'm just feeling it this morning get out of the house tonight my mom's hosting like a little birthday celebration for her even though her birthday literally isn't until september 19th but we have my sister here and Aliyah's home from college for labor day weekend so we figured we do a celebration with them and then celebrate with her on her actual birthday with zane and i because it's on a tuesday so we'll just hang out with her that day so i think after zumba we'll run out and grab like a little something to bring she's getting pizza maybe i'll bring like a mozzarella tomato balsamic kind of platter sorry i'm always a chatty kathy with you guys in the morning <laughs> I just feel like I need to get all my thoughts out. Okay, let's start the day. Good morning. Hi. You're so cute. <laughs> Why those little noises are so cute? Benji's jealous. Hi, Benj. Good morning. Oh, hello. There you are, too. Morning necessities. Okay, Zumba completed. I'm gonna run into Aldi real quick right now. I wanna get some strawberries and blueberries. Tomorrow we're doing a little brunch with a little bit of friends and family, um, just to have like a little summer gathering before the weather goes away. So we're gonna make pancakes. So I wanna get the strawberries and blueberries for that. We need some plates, like paper plates for, you know, people to eat on. And I think I'm just gonna grab a little something here to bring to mom and dad's later. So let's go grab some things. Oh, there's puppies here. Hi. Hi, babies. We are back. Got some plates. Oh, I grabbed the sourdough. Baby, I got a sourdough bread. It looked really good at Aldi. I've been missing sourdough bread. I love just a good toasted piece of sourdough. For tonight, my parents are getting pizza for their house, but she was like, if you want to bring something, if not, just bring yourself. You don't need to bring anything. But we're doing like a birthday celebration for my mom, and I know she loves uh, the mozzarella and tomato platter with the balsamic and stuff, and I want to make it good because, I don't know, I just feel like, I feel like if I put the basil and then like fresh coarse salt on top, it'll be phenom. So I'm gonna chop up my own tomatoes. I got mozzarella, which is already sliced up, so that's nice. And then for tomorrow, for pancakes, I got strawberries and blueberries. That is that. Also, casualty. I don't know if this is Zane or Mai's fault because he helps me tan my back. So I don't know who missed it last night. Also, we were doing it in like lamp lighting. I don't know why I don't have the lights on so we could see better, but look at this. <laughs> Self-tan fail. I haven't failed that bad in a while. I'll have to fill it in and it'll, it'll look fine. At least it's in like a decent place where I can kind of hide it. Like if my arm is like this, it kind of just looks like I sweat it off. <laughs> But yeah, that was definitely a fail of last night. We've got two Amazon packages. Shall we unbox on this fine Saturday morning? Let's see what we got. I forgot. <laughs> Actually, I think one of them is, yep, here it is. Wow, oh, this is light. I got another pair of cowgirl boots because I'm trying to find a pair just, just to have in general, but also for the Beyonce concert. Um, got a pair from Walmart and I was like iffy on them, but I'm like, but I've never tried on any other type. So I was like, let me try like a light brown shorter boot and see, like compare the two and see how I feel. So I just Amazon these. The other ones I have are like a cream whitish color. So I don't know if I would like this color better. And Amazon is great with their returns. So I figured why not just try. Oh, these are comfy. <laughs> They're gonna love these. That was sarcasm. Actually, I think I like these better than the Walmart ones. Where's my sister when you need her? Sissy, I need you to judge my Texas boots. Wait, I think I like these better. Huh. What do you think, Bench? 
Are these better than the tall white ones? Look at them boots. You like them better than the white ones? I think these give more cowboy boots. The other ones are more like just boots. I agree with that. Yeah, so like if I'm gonna get a cowgirl boot, like make them look like a cowgirl boot. Mm -hmm. These boots are go made for walking. Yeah, if you're gonna go big or go home. Precisely. Bailey, what do you think? Yeah. I actually. Bailey! Oh my god, your name is Bailey! You like these cowgirl boots? Bailey's going to the function, the country function. Mom, me. She's like, Mom, absolutely not. But I do think that the name Bailey is like Southern Belle. Southern Bailey. I think I like these better. Let me go get the other ones, baby, okay? And then you're gonna tell me. They fit great, too. Here are the other ones that I got. In comparison, what do we think? Keep both? <laughs> See, these are more cowgirl boots. white, you look like Doug Dimadone. Who oh, the man. hell is Doug Dimadon? Who's that? Oh, the guy from uh, Fairly Odd Parents. Huh? <laughs> you ever watch Fairly Odd Parents? Fairly Odd Parents? Fairly Odd Parents. Fairly Odd Parents. I think it is Fairly, but I always. Is that a Mandela effect? I think I always thought Fairy because they're fairies. Regardless, the guy with the cowboy hat. Odd Parents. Fairly arena. Odd Parents. Yeah, it's Fairly. What? That's a stupid issue, Fairy. That's what he says. I mean, that's what he wears. The tall one? He's a cowboy. Oh. I agree with you. I like the brown better. Is it because of the length or is it because of the color? These are more comfortable because they're less they're less of a heel. Oh, that's good. Yeah. It looks like a cowboy boot. The other one, like you said. Just looks, looks like a looks boot. Like a regular boot. Yeah. These are good like if you're a bride and you're like bachelor parties in like Nashville. Sissy! She's hungover from the wedding. Oh yeah, true. I guess I can go upstairs. <laughs> this is a great outfit to, you know, try it on with. I'm coming! <laughs> uh oh. I need your Texas opinion. What do we think? The brown, right? That's what I'm thinking too. Uh, what you did to do your spray tan? Yeah, do I look good? Except yeah. look. Look at that. Oh no. <laughs> Casualty. Oh, <laughs> at least happened? it looks like I sweat it off. Yeah, that's true. Can you just put more Zane there? Zane does my back, so I think it was his fault. Yeah, I'm gonna just put more and fill it's it getting in. Getting you back from falling down the stairs. I forgot to tell you guys about that. <laughs> this, happened, this happened. This happened yesterday. It was actually. Now it's funny, and we were laughing about it yesterday too. But it wasn't funny. So at the time. it wasn't funny at the time. So at the top of the basement stairs, I'll sometimes like put something on the top step, off to the side, not right in the middle, but. Zane doesn't like it because sometimes if he's in a rush or whatever and if he doesn't look down and he just goes down the stairs, he's like, I'm going to trip one day. I'm going to fall. And we've had this conversation so many times. I'm like, just look down before you go down the stairs, pick up whatever it is and bring it downstairs. Like, I just leave stuff at the top of the stairs that needs to go down. And if it's a cardboard box, usually I'll throw it down because that's where our recycling goes. But if it's like, I don't know, like some extra makeup or extra face products, I don't want to throw it. Really, I could just walk my ass down the stairs, let's be honest. But anyways, so he had yesterday, he was about to go teach a music lesson downstairs. He had fresh toast he made, he had a fresh iced coffee in his hand, and he had his giant jug water bottle, if you guys know, and there was a cardboard box there that's been there for like a week, and it was off to the side, so I don't, I don't know what happened, but I guess he just couldn't see because he was holding so much stuff, and he tripped. He didn't fall down, he just tripped a couple stairs, but everything fell out of his hands. The coffee splattered all over the walls, the toast got soaked with coffee, his water bottle fell down, and it was just like a a pent up like I've told you a million times not to put something on the top of the stairs. So I was like, whoopsie, sorry. So we're not gonna do that anymore. So he got back at you. He got back at me and he hat. messed up my tan. That was the whole point of that story. <laughs> You're even now. Yes. You like the brown better? What I think they wear look. It with? What am I gonna wear it with? Where is it Beyonce? I know. What do you, like? Uh, you... uh, maybe a dress. Yeah, they're cute. Where a dress. Did you get them from Amazon. Oh, yeah. How much were they? I think they were about like maybe in the range of forty to sixty dollars. That's not bad. Forty to sixty dollars. You don't go to Texas. You don't go to Texas with my Amazon boots. I might have a Texas theme shower, so maybe you could wear those white boots. Should I keep both? I mean, I don't know how much were those boots. These were thirty-eight dollars from Walmart. I think you're gonna use them for something in the future. No. You I have white boots uh, that are not cowgirl boots. You can boots. wear the brown ones to the shower since you'll be there for, and you'll wear them. You can wear them the next day. Yeah, I definitely not packing both. No. For sure. The brown ones are cuter. Do we like the ones? Alyssa would buy fucking cowboy boots. They're very comfortable. Way more comfortable than those because these are a higher heel. Yeah. I just don't know how I feel about the length. You want it to be higher? Maybe. I think they're perfect. I think they're adorable. Let's get a little Texas dance. 
Well, dandy do. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Kind of idea. <laughs> Should have wore them to Zumba today. Imagine. <laughs> what are here? Alright, here they are in the mirror. Obviously, I'm wearing workout clothes. So, I think for the concert, I'm going to wear like denim shorts with a top or a dress. I haven't decided yet. But... I think they're cute. I just don't know, if, is this length like chuggy? Should they be taller or is this cute? I'm gonna go ask you guys on Instagram. <laughs> okay, moving on from the cowgirl boot debacle real quick. Guess what we're gonna do a taste test for. Oh my God, it looks so sad. Potato corn dogs, we'll make them in the air fryer. I think you have to preheat it. So preheating an air fryer to 355. Wait, what's this? Microwave and air fryer recommended. Microwave it first and then put it in there. 355? Oh, they're individually wrapped. Oh. I mean, to be fair, that's Costco's MO. But I thought it was in clear. Package, I thought it was in a clear package. Yeah, they put a lot of time into this. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Oh, and there's uh, instructions on here. Let's see what they look like. Cute! <laughs> Cute! <laughs> they look like little corn dogs. So they're gonna be bigger? Longer and thinner. They're short <laughs> Stubby. Just like me. <laughs> Short and stubby. Microwave for one minute for two of them. Also, I got distracted by the boots. I had another Amazon package to open. Let's see what it is. Ooh, so exciting. I got packing cubes. I just got my new little luggage, as you guys saw in the last vlog. And now I got these cute little packing cubes. So excited. And then also that black um, shorts romper that I have from Amazon that I really love. I just love it, so of course I had to get it in chocolate brown. And they're like literally like $12, so why not? Oh, this one actually feels kind of nicer than the other one. What? Whoa, this is like totally different. Huh, interesting. This one is like an athletic stretchy material. Sorry, so much sounds going on. This one is like a thick, like stretchy athletic material, and the other one is like thin, does not suck you in or anything. Weird, okay, but I'll take it. First impression is it smells like french fries, which makes sense because it's potatoes. I was gonna put a little air fryer liner, but I feel like I wanna do it without, so. Let's just put them in there. 355, 12 minutes. Moment of truth. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh that's hot, okay. Oh, my yum. So when I've gotten these like out of place and when I made them at home, I like to eat them with ketchup and they also dip them in sugar. So I don't know how I feel about doing that just yet. I think I'm gonna try it without first. Gotta get a picture for my Costco review. Binjaroo. So when we got them, when we get them, they roll them in sugar. Remember when we made them at home, we rolled them in sugar too? Yeah, it was really weird because like cheese and sugar. But it just, it's like a good combo. You can try it without ketchup. Okay. Mmm. Now I'll go for a little ketchup. There's a little sweetness in there. Oh, 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 no cheese hole. Oh, good. They're hot. It's like cheesy french fries. Mm -hmm. Kind of. They're solid. Wanna buy again? Oh, well. It has like the flavor of like pancake batter a little bit. Yeah, there's like a dough in here. But that's what it's supposed to be. I know, I just don't think I'm a big fan of this oh. invention. Yeah, I definitely went out and got them a few times because I like them that much. Mm. They're like two it is good though. ones. Don't get it twisted. It is good. It's a treat. It's just fried dough with cheese and potatoes on it. Mm hmm Well, I was with you when we tried it once in uh, Oh, yeah, Flushing. I brought you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it does taste, like, very similar. Yeah. I like when they do it with sweet potatoes. I want it to be more savory. Maybe it needs salt. Yeah, I was thinking some salt. I definitely like it with the ketchup. Yeah, the ketchup is fire. Better. Mm-hmm. I'm very disappointed there's no cheese pull. Yeah. That's one of the differences. Huh. It doesn't really pull that much. Let me try. No cheese pull. <laughs> Why is that, you think? Mm. She's like too dense. I don't know. The first time I got these, I remember me and my friends were like, mm. Yeah. So it's well, a frozen version, I guess. Where did you get it from the first time? It's all. It's called OK Dog in the city. Mm. We went to a different place. Yeah. No, we did. No, it, that was OK Dog. It was just a different location. Um, I've got my rating. It's in it. Eight out of ten. Oh, that's but, a good rating. But seven out of ten for me is edible because I just love food. You know what I mean? 
Like, I'm very generous with my ratings. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll throw out 10 out of 10s all day. Like, this was good. Like, if you made another one right now, I would eat it. A little salt, a little ketchup. But would I repurchase? No. There you go. A little bit. My rating? Um, I think I would go for an 8 out of 10, too. Do you have a similar scale like me, though? No. I'm generous. Yeah. They don't taste as good as the places the more that I eat it, but it's like if you're craving something like this, like a fried, doughy, cheesy. It tastes like something you'd get at a carnival. Yeah. Good crunch, like a kettle cooked chip. Mm hmm. Quick update on the boots, by the way. I'm still undecided. These are not as comfortable because they're a higher heel. So I would love to get something with a lower heel. So I just ordered a brown pair with a lower heel and it'll be here tomorrow. And then we shall decide. So I really do like the color of these and they're comfortable, but I'm going to compare these and these and then I'll decide. Anywho, let's go on a bike ride. I'm going to copy Zane and wear my Crocs. What a great shoe. Good shoe. I actually am... <laughs> It's so funny, it's all about shoes today with the cowboy boots and stuff. I'm also looking at Ugg slippers because I've never had a pair and I feel like I would wear these so much. So I'm debating on which ones I want right now. Everyone's saying right now that if you wait for winter time, they're all gonna be sold out. So you gotta get them now. Smart. Yeah. Went in the trails today. Oh, this is so nice. Wow. It's beautiful out today. Oh, feels good to get out. I've done so much exercising the last two days. <laughs> Yesterday I did my HIIT workout. I walked so much. Oh my god, there's someone coming. I walked so much on the treadmill and today I did Zumba and now we're on a bike ride. And it feels great. <sighs> oh my god. <sighs> I'm gonna go lift. <sighs> lift things up and put them down? Huh? Lift things up and put them down? Mm hmm. I feel like I just ran a marathon. <sighs> Here's what Aura Ring says 3.3 miles. Woo! 3.3 miles in 29 minutes. Which is good. Okay, well, that was so much fun. Just got changed into my bathing suit. Look at my <laughs> sports bra. <laughs> I haven't rinsed off my tanner yet, so I guess I like sweat. It just rubbed off my tan, but I let it develop. So hopefully once I rinse, it'll all be even. Oh, I forgot to touch this up too. I have to go do that. Um, In my bathing suit, this is from Amazon. I love it. I love that it's strapless. I love the bottoms. It's nice and thick, comfortable. I'm gonna go outside for a little bit. We're heading to mom's in about like, two and a half hours ish um so i'm just gonna relax for a little bit enjoy this saturday i forgot that i had this and i'm hoping that it's in it oh best by january we're good this is like a sesame beef jerky korean beef jerky well it's pork pork jerky pretty far i honestly forgot we had it so i haven't like reached for it but i guess i wouldn't buy it again because if i forgot that we had it it means it wasn't that memorable, right? Wow, what a beautiful day. It's like the perfect weather. It's gonna be hot the next few days. I will be right here. <laughs> All right, for some reason, it's taking me a long time to get through this. Well, I know why, I've just been busy. I haven't really picked up my book. I read like a little bit at night, but I'm 35% done with my last Colleen Hoover book. It's called Never Never, and I actually had to renew it. I rented it from the Libby app, but like from our public library, and it was gonna expire soon, and I was like, oh, I'm not done. It's like I'm dragging through the last book of hers, and I really wanna finish it, so we're gonna make some good progress on this right now. Okay, well, update. I didn't read not one word of my book because my parents stopped by, and we were chatting, and then I just went on the hunt for, like, the Ugg slippers that I wanted, and I found them. I got them at Bloomingdale, so hopefully by the time you guys are seeing this, they're still in stock. They are so cute. They're called mustard seed, the color, which is interesting, um, but it's like this light sandy beige color. They were hard to find. Like Even on the Ugg website, they don't even sell this color anymore, but they had them on like other websites and they were just out of stock. I don't know, but I found them on Bloomingdale's, and they have the platform ones too, which are really cute, but I don't know. I just feel like that, I don't know. I feel like I would look funny in them. I just feel like these I'll wear way more. For some reason, like I love my platform Converse, but I don't know about a shoe like this being platform. I feel like I just want more casual, kind of, if that makes sense. There's another platform that's like Sherpa, white Sherpa, that's really cute, but I'm gonna get these first. Everyone, I see all over social media, like snag your Uggs now, like get your Uggs before winter starts because they're gonna be all sold out. So I'm so glad that I got these. Now I want them, like I wanna wear them all the time. Like I just know like I'm gonna wear those all the time. So very excited about that. Um, I'm gonna go inside now. I'm gonna go rinse this tan off put on a little bit of makeup. And I'm gonna make the mozzarella platter with you guys. The basil smells so fire. I'm so excited to get to use it. It's getting chilly out here. The sun's going down, so I'm gonna go for a nice leggings and a crew neck, which is phenomenal. Okay, 
let's do it. Also, update on this little guy from Amazon. Look, it works. Got some mosquitoes on there, got little gnats on there. Very happy. That just saved us two mosquito bites. So fresh and so clean out of the shower. I put on moisturizer and I'm about to use Smashbox Scent Over PR, which is iconic because this is literally a product that I've purchased and I love. It is the Smashbox Halo Healthy Glow All-in-One Tinted Moisturizer that has SPF 25 in it. They also send over some concealers, which you can try. I've never tried those, but I love this tinted moisturizer and I just want like a light little coverage for tonight. Just doing it with Zayn and I's small, you know, immediate sides of the family just to celebrate while Aaliyah's here while my sister is here. Jerry made a cake and Aaliyah made dirt dessert. If you guys watched our engagement party vlog, <laughs> you know, dirt dessert. That's like one of my favorite drunk clips ever, to be honest. So I'm excited to have that. Mom's getting pizza. I'm gonna make the mozzarella stuff. It's gonna be good. We have to leave in like 30 minutes though, so I'm just gonna do like a quick little coverage. Oh my god, also, oh, she's texting me right now, so my friend Brenna's coming tomorrow. I think I said, yeah, I'm doing a little brunch. I'm having like, my sister wanted to see our cousins, and then we have a few of my sister's friends are coming, Zane and my family, and then I'm having my friend Brenna come. And I was thinking about it, because I know Zane would be really excited. I mean, I already told him, so it's like no surprise now, but my friend Brenna has a golden retriever, and he is adorable. His name is Sunny. And I was like, do you wanna bring him tomorrow? Because we're doing like an outdoor barbecue. It's gonna be hot out, pool. But she said that she's down to bring him, so I'm so excited. She was like, yeah, but he might go in the pool. I was like, as he should. So you guys are gonna get a treat tomorrow. You're gonna see the cutest golden retriever ever. He's adorable. I'm sure it's great for her too, because she probably feels terrible leaving him at home, especially on a beautiful day. I'm like, bring him over. We got the grass he can lay on. He can go in the pool. <laughs> so cute. Get our little dog fix in, because <laughs> we ain't getting on. <laughs> oh, here it comes. Okay. Let's try this concealer. Whoa, that was a lot. Spread it out. I got a little pimple right here. I think it's because of all the food I've been eating and I've been a little stressed and PMSing, which I don't know where my period is, which is not a good sign. Uh, hopefully it'll come soon. Or, I mean, I'm sure it's gonna be a little regular while my body's getting used to the new method of birth control. So I'm sure it's normal. Oh, I should have let it dry a little bit. I usually let it get a little tacky. Oh, wow. That's really nice, huh? That is very nice coverage, I feel like. I was gonna wash my hair just now in the shower, but then I'm like, we're gonna sit outside, we're gonna do the fire, I'm gonna smell like fire, I'm going to Zumba in the morning, I'll just wash it. And we're doing pool tomorrow, so I'm like, I could jump in the pool, leave my hair dirty, I think I'll wash it tomorrow. <laughs> but it's been going on a good amount of time now. I washed it uh, Tuesday night and it's Sunday. Oh my God, Tuesday night. So Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. No, today's Saturday. It's been four days. Tomorrow will be five. That's crazy for my thin hair. Usually it would look awful and it's not that bad and throw some dry shampoo in it and clip it up okay it's already 5 39 let's wrap this up quick a little bit of liquid contour i'm gonna do a little bit of liquid blush mascara and then we'll go make the food i've been looking for any chilly night excuse to wear my new brooklyn sweatshirt tonight's the night sign me up for that please oh yes yes all right how what do i want to do with this hair hmm? what do we want to do here hair here, hair. Um, pretty dirty. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we got going on here. First of all, <laughs> try shampoo, <jump> please. <laughs> right in my face. <laughs> try shampoo. Should we just run a straightener through it? Call it a day. Do we want to just put it back in a pony? Just clip it. Just give it a little clip. Save some time because we gotta go make the little food dish. Cool. We'll call it there for right now. Maybe I'll straighten it. First of all, let's go get our basil. Fresh basil. Look at those little muggies. You're just so lazy today. You've been there for so long. Oh yes. There's a crisp in the air and I love it. Oh, I knew I was gonna leave this out here. <laughs> Whoopsies. <laughs> we don't need too much. Just gonna, you know, put a little on top. So let's break off a few big leaves so I can roll it and chiffonade. Oh, you guys are dying. Of course. Of course you are. Oh, it smells so good. I like this one right here. I think that's good. Bring this inside, switch your battery, and then we're gonna make it. Here's what we got going down. I'm gonna put it on this platter. We've got the basil, salt, mozzarella, tomatoes, and the glaze. Let's do it. Rinse these off. I'm walking down 
the street on clouds instead of the concrete I'm dancing through Everything's about to come my way Nothing can ruin my date No matter what anyone does or say I smile at no. no, I don't care cause I am Sissy, it's going out in chunks Can I have the date on it? October 12th of 2024. Uh, it needs like a little water. Yeah. Yeah, that looks like. Stop. <laughs> What's happening? Oh, that just ruined my whole vibe. Maybe it's not supposed to be in the refrigerator? Why? It is. Oh, is it not? Maybe it becomes jelly. So maybe just let it like. Do not refrigerate. Maybe let it get room temperature and then it'll come back together. So just don't put it on there yet. When you get there, put it on. I already ruined it. Yeah, it needs to sit. Got like coagulated. I didn't know you were supposed to refrigerate it. Okay, well, fail. It still looks beautiful. I'm just gonna throw on my basil and we'll do it when we get there. I wish I tested it elsewhere first. I try to wipe it off. No. Mm, it looks like a little worm. Stop. It's good for like Halloween. Mm. Stop. Alrighty, well, uh. <laughs> 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 I guess I was not supposed to refrigerate this. I guess that's why I got all chunky. So I started to put it on and I was like, uh oh, that is not going on nicely. So I stopped and we're gonna let it get to room temp on the way there. Um, I've never made one of these boards before, but I know mom loves them. So I tried to do it justice. Look at my sad, sad balsamic. What? It'll still taste good. It's just coming out like when honey gets crystallized. I didn't yeah. realize it says do not refrigerate. Oh, really? So it got like chunky and cold, yeah. You know what we should do real quick? Run it under hot water before we leave to speed up the process. But yeah, hopefully I did this justice because I tried to make mom happy. I know she loves this. I did some fresh basil and some salt on top, which I feel like a lot of people don't do, and I feel like that'll make it better. All right, we made it work. Mom said, screw it, and she did it herself. <laughs> I don't think she knew that it was that you were going to wait. What? Wait for what? No, no, I told her. I just explained it to her, and she was like, I'll do it. Oh, yeah, but it's Okay, it worked out? Okay, good. I'm glad you guys like it. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. One or two? 75. Keep going. Not 61. 21. 21 forever. Good for your age. Woo! It's time for bedtime. Good night, mugs. Good night. Good morning. Happy Sunday, everyone. Had such a nice night last night with the fam. Just relaxed. We sat by the fire. Yummy food. My mozzarella and tomato dish was a hit. And then we came back watching tennis and we knocked. Here we are. My friend is not teaching her Zumba class this morning, so I had a nice leisurely morning. Did not go to Zumba. And we're gonna have a nice little brunch here at the house. So I just started the morning by, you know, doing my little morning routine. I changed the garbage. And now we're just gonna start cleaning and setting up. It is 9.43 a.m. And everyone's coming at 12. So we're gonna make pancakes. We have people bringing stuff. Someone's bringing bacon. My friend's bringing like a big box of coffee. We're gonna make some eggs. We have leftover dirt dessert from yesterday that Aaliyah made, so fire. And it's gonna be a nice, beautiful, Sunday, so I'm gonna start by putting the pool vacuum in and then I'm gonna put all my laundry away just so that's done and dusted and then start setting up outside put out all the cushions and stuff It is already hot and it is not even 10 a.m. So it's gonna be a perfect pool day We've been keeping up with the pool and it's been beautiful So I want it to stay that way So I'm gonna put the pool vacuum in so that it's all done before everyone gets here This is the stuff that changed our life highly highly recommend if you have a cloudy pool We put in that much into our pretty big in-ground pool like that's literally it and ever since we did that it has not been cloudy literally at all and it has rained so much every time it rained it was so cloudy this is phenomenal so highly recommend if you have a pool we've been vacuuming it regularly skimming it you know we haven't even shocked it since we put that stuff in it's just been great okay there she goes run forest run yeah <laughs> Love that. I guess it's also finally time to take down <laughs> this balloon from the party. She's seen better days. No, I don't care because I am on my way up and I won't stop. I won't slow down. Standing on my feet, I'm going to rise up. No, I won't stop. It is my time. Because mm -hmm. I know what it's like to be broke. 
what it's like when nothing goes your way So I'm gonna let myself enjoy the fruit from this lucky day Yeah, I am on my way up I won't slow down Yeah, I am on my way I won't slow down I'm strolling down the street With all of my favorite songs on repeat I'm dancing through Everything's about to come my way And I don't care if you spill coffee on me Or if the sky is gray or blue No, I don't care cause I am on my way Up and I won't stop I won't slow down Standing on my feet I'm gonna rise up No, I won't It is my time Cause I know what it's like to be broke, yeah And I know what it's like when nothing goes your way So I'm gonna let myself enjoy There you are! <laughs> I'm coming! I'm so excited for him! <laughs> Oh, you're just gonna sit there. Ah, it's gonna lay in it. Ah, yeah. there you Mark go. Doggy. Uh oh, dog cake. Uh -uh. <laughs> Thirsty? He's scared? He's never, oh! He's never been in a pool. You have a, a little one? I have like a little kiddie pool, but I take him to the beach a lot and he swims there. Yeah. So I, I think he'll like it. He wants the ball. Yeah. That's what you want? Go here. Uh oh. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Oh, oh, you can do it. He's scared. Come on, we're going in. There you go. Yeah, Follow maybe he'll go with you. I'm gonna get my ball. Look. <laughs> I'm gonna get my ball. He's you scared. Can do it. Yeah. He doesn't feel any bottom. Yeah. See his foot? Yeah. He's like, <laughs> like where's the, the floor? <laughs> Don't be a puppy! Don't be a puppy! You're not a puppy anymore! Come on! It's so nice and freezing! It's <laughs> so cold! It's so cold! Yeah, but you'll, you'll get used to Come it. It's hot out. Come on! Come on! Come on! <laughs> he doesn't see the next step. Yeah. Come on! You can do it! Maybe let's do a hug. He just doesn't away. see that there's another step if you back up a little, maybe. Maybe lure him with the ball. Yeah, like, yeah. You can do it, you're a big boy. Hold it. Me in the pool? Oh so me! I would never do that to you. He's looking at you like, you see it, right? Look. <laughs> you see what she did to me? That was so mean. So Jacqueline, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah. like, where is the next step? <laughs> Look, Liz can't reach it. <laughs> it's in the deep end. <laughs> Yay! He's like, yeah, now I'm like 50 pounds oh. heavier with all that water. <laughs> <gasps> Ready? Which way is he coming? <gasps> He's this way. Uh oh. <laughs> Swimming. Look how happy he is. <laughs> oh, he loves you. <laughs> He's like, this guy likes me. I know it. I know it. Someone new. Someone new. Oh, he's coming. <laughs> you want to play catch? <laughs> All right, everyone's starting to trickle out. Such a hot, beautiful day. Beautiful summer day. Look at DIY dad over here. Knocked out. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. We're doing family reading, I'm making everyone read. Fancy. Dad's got Verity, Sissy's got November 9. Mom's got It Starts With Us still. And I'm reading Never Never. Excuse me, I am on 242.47. Nice. 
All right, Sissy and I are ending the night having a sissy night. We did this last time too. Sauce. We had like one sissy night. Yeah. General Tao sauce. More sauce. Crab ragoons. Sweet and sour. Beef chow fun. Sauces. That's it. We're gonna share all this. Oh, I've had those noodles before. They're good. Is that good? Oh my god, that's. Ow. That's so fucking much. Yeah, it's good. Why wow, you took a noodle back? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you took Have you, you eat like movie? a bird anyway. The menu? No. Oh my god, it's so good. I dip it in General Tso's sauce. I don't know if you would like to do that as Worth well. Worth it. Okay. <laughs> what fucking question is that? It's my jam. I right love there. sauces. Me too. If there's no sauce, you're at your mind. If there's no ice cream cake, I'm not coming. Okay. Previously on Claim to Fame. Claim to Fame. Oh my god, the sauce is on fire. It's gonna be the best. Be you dip this in here. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's a lot. Oh, I was gonna kind of spicy. I do just a little, a little dabble. A dabble do. Claim to fame time, baby. We're almost done, right? We might be able to finish it tonight. If I don't fall asleep. What time is it? Oh god, it's 8.15. We're approaching bedtime. <laughs> so I did in fact fall asleep on the finale. It is a little while later now. It's actually Friday, September 8th, the day that you're watching this. If you're watching it on the day that I upload it, I'm about to throw this in and hit export. So thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. Thanks again to Factor for sponsoring. Make sure you go check them out. Linked down below. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you all next time. Enjoy some bloopers. Bye. Mama wanna mambo. Baby, why don't we go, we go somewhere we can mumble, mumble. Water bottle down. I thought I was going in the pool. Whoa, whoa! I feel the rush, addicted to. Uh, it's the Halo, Smashbox Halo Healthy All-in-One. Healthy Glow, did I just butcher that? Like, or did I just butcher that? Whoa! Concealer. Oh, lipstick. Last night we let the liquor talk. <laughs>